Hey guys, RC here. Welcome back. Episode 14 of The Journeyman. We're playing FM 18. And I just noticed I am recording this today on uh, Thursday, December 21st. And I just noticed that there was a uh, an update to the game that just came out a few minutes ago. So I have not updated yet since I've been playing. Um, as we talked about, I came back for the very next match, Mathatha Bucks. And I have dialed in a just a basic 442. I've dropped that in. And I've just changed a few things. And any of the uh, automatic, I have switched to. Bless me. Sorry about that. I have uh, changed any of the automatic to support. And because uh, road is on support, I have put. Mafiango on attack over here. Uh, we do have a few guys on the bench. And familiarity is actually pretty decent with this because we've been playing a 4-4-2 for the most part. Uh, I am going to play a counter structured. And I'm just going to leave everything else the same for right now just to see how it transpires. So, uh, you'll notice uh, Nadiki, our new guy, has dropped back to uh, fullback. And, uh, you know, he, he can actually play several positions. So, not the end of the world there. That may be an upgrade back there anyway. So... Oh, the black and gold. That's an interesting look. All right. Corner. Oh, cleared out from the near post. That's a rare occurrence. One shot here in the first 15 minutes. Oh, went over his head. That was... uh. That was class. All right, we are not having any possession. That's okay. I want to give this an opportunity to see what it does. Probably need to put, oh my god, he had to have been off sides, huh? Come on. Well, at least he missed. That was bad. Just threw it right to him. That's crap. That is such crap. <laughs> threw it right to him. All right. Lag, hello. All right, Mabundia. Lifts it. Come on, kick it to my guy so we can score the empty netter. That would be great. Out. So we've given up five shots, four full half chances, but they have not uh, made anything stand up yet. A heel kick. Out deep. Oh, get it out. Oh, that was a good finish from the top of the box. Sandil Sabandi. That name sounds familiar. He might have played for me at Ubuntu, huh? Where is he at? Midfielder? No? Okay. I played against him. I guess that's why the name stuck out. Alright. So, things are not going great. And I think we can evaluate that right now. All right. So, what do we want to do? Well, 
don't want to change anything here so this is where we want to go in for the structure right first thing let's go to shorter passing and a little bit higher tempo because we're on counter and again I've always heard you don't want to change a ton of things so let's just change that and see what happens now not expecting a lot here in the early going because it was halftime all right uh, yeah show me something else in the second half all right well, over the top, oh, Mazabo, and he let him kick it out of bounds instead of getting a little cross in. Okay, that works for me. Bundia, another corner. Oh, right to the keeper. Hey, that counts as a shot. We'll take it. <laughs> we'll take it. Beggars can't be choosers. 12 to 1. Set piece in. All right. They've got a counter coming out. Anybody playing horrible? Mazabo's not playing good. I want to bring in... Uh, Let's bring Africa in up top and Pulse. Let's bring him in in the mid center. It's like he just froze and, like, oh, I don't want to touch him. <laughs> oh my god. We're actually, oh. Road with the uh, steel there. Oh, plays it up. Mizubo. Crossed in. Header. Nice finish. Brandon Williams coming up from the midfield to make that. I think that was his first goal of the season. All right. A little sign of life. So two shots. Both have been on target. Williams making that run. Just put it right over the keeper's head. I think it scared the keeper, freaked him out. All right, we've got a couple of subs coming on here. All right, they go to a 4-3-3. Three, three. That's going to be... Uh, not sure what they're trying to do there. Oh, an injury. Okay. Uh, that's going to be a mid right or a winger. I don't think I have anybody that can play out there. Uh, Gog is probably the closest guy. I can play out there. He's going to come back to training tomorrow, so he won't be in the best shape. But Oh, wide. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. I'm going to be very happy with a draw in this match if we can pull one. You know, one doing a brand new tactic. Oh, Africa. Look out. Look out. Oh, look how fast he got up. That was insane. Like superhuman reflexes. Uh, Africa said, I'm not running after that one. I'm tired now. <laughs> you got my one good run for the match. Oh, look out. And from range, that wasn't good. That broke our streak there, man. Come on. Yeah, I mean, you know, I, don't let them score here. Oh, my God, please. Oh, it hit their own guy. Shh. All right, come on. Hoof it down. Road. 
Oh, taken down in the box. Can we steal another one on a penalty? Oh, this would be insane. Oh, the guy was nice enough to put it on the spot for us. That was nice of him. All right, who's taking it? It's got to be Road, right? Pulse. Oh, buries it. Nice as can be. It's going to be another victory that we can steal with a PK. That's going to be awesome. Just placed it right behind the keeper. Oh, we'll take that. We'll take that. We FM'd him, I think. That's a big victory for us, up to 15 points. There's a cluster of us there. That's six points out of relegation, so that's good. We have uh, minus, we're, we're half the goal differential, so that's good. So basically they need three games to catch us because they need to get past us. So that's good. And, I, you know, I'm not worried about, you know, being top of the table and, and we're in this bunch I mean we're only one point out of eighth position again so I will count that as a victory I appreciate the effort good job uh, let's see we come back when it doesn't even say <laughs> oh seven days all right so six to nine days all right, so Gongo will be back from his collarbone. He's been out for a while. We'll lose him for about a week. And, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and come back for Real Kings. We'll be back here uh, for you guys uh, in just a minute. So we're back. We actually lost a player, <laughs> one of my starters, uh, here in the last couple of days. And maybe you can help me figure out what happened. So uh, originally I got the this email or notice that the Magic, who we have signed a uh, agreement to play a friendly at the New Year break, was had offered a contract on a free because he's on a he was on a non contract with us. So then uh, I immediately went into him, offered him a new contract. He did not want, his request was not for any money, salary-wise. It was a per-appearance fee. So I understand being able to get out on a free transfer. But, uh, you know, I was kind of hoping that giving him what he wanted per appearance uh, would cause him to stay, but uh, he still signed with them. Now, I cannot see his contract, um, so it does not tell me what... what he's getting paid now we just got Ganga back so so he's gonna actually be a decent replacement um, even in the 442 here um, and road is available to play in that area so you know it says only sign him as a last resort so maybe that's maybe it's a good thing that they signed him but I mean he, he had six starts for us uh, so anyway uh, not sure you know like I said he had just signed that contract extension you know renewal with me for a higher per appearance fee and then left anyway and of course when I go to try to sign him back or, or at least to look at it he says, "Well, oh, I'm not interested, boss. I just, you know, I just joined my new club." So, anyway, uh, we're back to take on Real Kings. Very happy with uh, the results of that last match. So let's pick the entire team. Gonga will be back in here 
the Dickey it back on the back line September in the starting lineup so let's play some soccer man They're playing a 4-3-3. Um, the only thing I did tactically, let's take a look at it, is I added, I basically went to what we did in the second half of the last match, a little bit higher tempo on a counter, shorter passing. That's all I had done. Now I've added work the ball into the box. So that's the only thing I've changed for this match. Uh, we are again in white with the blue sleeve. They are in the blue with the white uh, venting, I guess. All right, so we are actually controlling the match here early on. Coming back a little bit, but at 60%. Um, oh, my God. What a save by Trumpeter. Is it still? Oh, no, okay. I was like, was it still in play? All right. All right, a highlight for us. Muhammad over to Williams. Into Road, who gets tackled and loses it. The Dickey comes up to control it. September gets the ball back up into play. All right, Mavundia, what are you going to do? Through ball into the box for Pulse. Can't do anything with it. Resetting again. Mavundia into the box again. Oh, Williams. Williams with a cheeky little shot to the far post. That was a nice finish. I'll take that. Tell you what, we are controlling this, so I am actually going to go up to uh, control. See if that generates a little more activity for us. I mean, we seem to be down on their end of the pitch an awful lot. All right now, they're looking like they're coming back a little bit. Still at a 4 3 3. Oh my god. What is this? The WWE? I mean, it literally just took him down in the box. Oh. Hey, you went the right way, Trumpeter, but you can't stop a penalty shot. I don't think that's in your repertoire. I mean, good shot. He put it right on the post. So certainly nothing wrong there. Oh, Tima. All right, a deep ball. Oh, look at the pace. Oh. It's just blazing. All right, Pulse, Williams. All right, setting up the attack. Avundia right into the legs of the defender. That's awesome. That takes pinpoint accuracy, you know. They're really good at it. All right, Nadiki. Oh, there's a nice deep ball into Ganga. Crossed. Oh, Williams pings it from range. All right, so we have seven long shots. Mm. Can we see... Can we see... All right, this is this is our side. That's not what I want. Match stats. Oh, Nadiki made the mistake leading to that goal. That's not good. All right, um... All right, deep line forward, hold the ball up, shoot less often. All 
dribble more, move into channels. Williams is an 8.2, but I'm going to tell him to shoot less often. I want the ball getting moved into the box. I, I'm not going to have any overlap because I don't have anybody here attacking. Now, maybe, does does look for overlap work on your winger deep-lying forward? Does that... I don't know. That's that's something I don't know. All right. Uh, encourage the team. We'll do that. All right. So we just tweaked a couple of players on the player instructions. That's all we did here. All right. Possession is coming back, it appears. So maybe. All right. We're 60 minutes. Let's drop back to counter. Let's do that. I want to pop in some subs here. All right, Ganga. Don't have anybody there, do you? Um. All right, Mazabo for Pulse. Uh, Mogopo or Tima, who's having the worst game. And we'll just go with two. All right, highlight. Dickey, Williams, Ganga. Oh, look at that! Mavundia! A Mavundla, not Mavundia. First goal. First goal of his career for our side. All right, that was a nice uh, nice cross by him. Surprised it made it past the defender. But we get the, we get the goal. With 13 shots, I think we've done okay. The eight long shots I would like to... That's what I need to look at. I need to look at uh, shots. And first half, number seven, who is that? Let me put my team up here, Sternberg. All right, so that is Williams, 16, who's 16? Oh, that's Pulse. Okay, he was a forward. He was in Mazabo's spot. And number six is Mavundia. So, okay. So I think Williams, one, two, three, that's six long shots in the first half. Second half, none, huh? It says we had nine. Overall, two, three, four. Oh, number 11, Mazabo had one. Yeah, most of them are Williams, so maybe putting Williams on the, uh, maybe putting Williams on shoot less was a good idea. All right, we're up 2-1. We've gone back to counter. 83rd minute. Fury. Boondia, he's at 60. Yeah, we'll bring him off. Get some fresh legs on the pitch. Four minutes. Oh, shit. It always happens when I do that. Bernard is injured. Shoulder injury. Crap. Um... No. No. He can play defensive mid. All right. 
So, what do I want to do here? I think we're going to go there. We're going to take off. Uh, the dicky can. Oh, you can actually place center. Um, okay, I am tempted. All right, you appear to be my best center defender. All right, we're going to do that. I want you on defense, ball-winning midfielder. I'm going to bring you back in support. Oh, do I dare bring him back and drop him even farther? I don't know. I just made that substitution too. Son of a bitch. All right. Um. Team instructions. Just clear the ball to the flanks. Um. Much. Let's play deeper. And uh, go route one. Stick to positions. And we're going to play narrow. Oh, we've done we've done well this match. This is killing me. Hopefully we can make it stand up. Well, you know, playing a man short there. I was nervous. Nervous. But we will take it. We got another win. We are up to ninth in the table. That is excellent. If you've listened to me do the two recordings today, this episode and last episode, I recorded the same day. Uh, it's early on a Thursday morning. Uh, in fact, during this episode, you probably heard some background noise uh, as some of the households started waking up. Uh, we're having a, a special ceremony at the uh, cancer hospital for my son today, uh, who, you, as you guys know, uh, went into remission just a couple of weeks ago. So we've got some family came into town yesterday, um, but I've been recording because I knew I was going to be gone most of the day. So I uh, wanted to get a little recording done and I couldn't sleep this morning, so I was up at about 3.30 uh, this morning. And uh, so I came down, but I was trying to keep it quiet, <laughs> you know, with uh, with people sleeping and whatnot. So uh, if you were going, man, he's kind of reserved today, that's why. Uh, but very happy with this win. Um, appreciate their efforts. Then we play the preliminary round of the, uh, the cup here. All right. Three, oh my god, three to four months. So we could shave some time with a little bit of money. All right, let's do that. Williams was good. Uh, okay, well. All right, so two wins this episode. Two games that I did not think we would win when we came back and played these top 10 clubs. So very happy. Ninth position. Five wins, three draws, six defeats. Still not a good side, but we're playing well. Uh, <laughs> Ubuntu Cape Town, 10 defeats in, in last position. Uh, we were never that bad with me as their coach. Maybe they shouldn't have fired me. Of course, I was leaving anyway, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, yeah, so I think we're doing okay, guys. I'm really happy with the way the season's going. And uh, we've got the uh, preliminary and another friendly to keep us uh, fit during the holiday. So, uh, yeah, we'll come back uh, at some point. I, I may play a few matches here, but... Uh, want to try to do a couple of different clubs 
So actually, I need to go back and double check who I recorded. Let's see. I know we did Ubuntu and Polokwane. And then we did, uh, oh, I did the Stellenbach Richards Bay, but that didn't work. And we did Wit, Witbank and Black Leopards, right? And then we did, did we do the Cosmos game? I don't remember. That may have been the one I recorded this morning. May have done that one. I'll double check. But anyway, we'll probably come back uh, a little bit later. Maybe uh, somewhere in this uh, Highlands Park Super Eagles range. But I'll double check and see who we've recorded already. And try not to repeat any of those. Give me a thumbs up for two wins today. I'd appreciate it. Maybe we could get a new record and go for five likes on a video. What do you guys think? It's in your hands. Uh, subscribe if you're new to the channel. And uh, we'll see you next time. As always, thanks for your support. Thanks for hanging out with me for a little bit. And we will see you next time. Take care. Bye now.